This is obviously called the Easy Adder. It was made by the Kona Brothers in 1964 and was on the market for a few years, probably until about 1967 or 8. It has a dial on the front and the child would have to just put the put your finger in the number you want to add and turn. That adds that number to the total here. It automatically carries over. It can also subtract. There's a small switch here that you can move. And when you do that, these numbers change. And it now has a, a minus sign showing here. And these arrows also change direction. And when that happens, you can't turn it clockwise. You have to turn it anti-clockwise. And you can subtract. It doesn't really have a clearing mechanism, but you can turn this knob to uh, to change it. Uh, so if you want to set it to zero, you put it to subtraction mode and just turn it back all the way to zero. I don't understand why they didn't put a, a handle, a knob on this this wheel. But you can just about use that. So, so you, you can quietly move this to zero before you start uh, moving this, this to zero. Unfortunately, the carry mechanism means that this can't really turn properly if uh, this digit is zero or one. So, sorry, uh, nine or zero. So maybe that's why they didn't do that. It's not in great condition. It's missing part of this reset knob and some ink has been spilled on these uh, cardboard numbers. But I guess that just shows that it's been used. On the back there are the instructions. Very straightforward. This cardboard back can be removed to reach the mechanism. Here you can see that the units wheel has a single tab on it which uh, interacts with these uh, teeth on the tens wheel. So if I move the uh, dial forward Eventually, a carry occurs. This uh, latch here, this ratchet, that uh, this changes direction when the uh, uh, machine is switched from addition to subtraction. So it's now in addition, and uh, this uh, interacts with the teeth on this wheel. But if you move to subtraction, uh, yeah, this, this little tab moves over and blocks this one and releases this one. So now the dial can only move the other way. The TENS wheel has a little uh, spring here to align it to the full digits. This wheel also has some pins here, and that used to be uh, used for uh, the bell. There was an idea in the patent that there would be a bell on the side, and a little clapper would ring that bell each time this wheel moves. But uh, thankfully they removed that before uh, it went into production.
That was the Easy Adder by the Kona Brothers. Thank you for watching.